Hi, I'm Scientist Cindy. Let's learn about the circulatory system. The three components of the circulatory system are the heart, the blood, and the blood vessels. The circulatory system, also called the cardiovascular system, functions to circulate blood through the body. The cardiovascular system has red blood cells. They carry nutrients and oxygen to the cells. The red blood cells also carry away toxins and waste products, including carbon dioxide, from the cells. The function of the heart is to pump blood around the body. The heart does this by creating a pressure gradient that forces the blood to move around the body. The function of the blood vessels is to provide the network of passageways that allows the blood to travel throughout the body. The circulatory system circulates blood around two loops. The first one is the pulmonary circuit. This brings blood from the heart to the lungs back to the heart. The second loop is called the systemic circuit. The systemic circuit brings blood from the heart to the rest of the body and back to the heart. There are two major types of blood vessels, arteries and veins. The arteries carry blood away from the heart and veins carry blood to the heart. Be careful, not all arteries are red and not all veins are blue. The red coloring in the illustration indicates that the blood carried in those vessels is oxygenated. The blue coloring in the illustration indicates that the blood carried in those vessels is deoxygenated. However, they are carrying carbon dioxide. In the pulmonary circuit, the heart pumps deoxygenated blood to the lungs. These blood vessels are going away from the heart, so they are called arteries. These are called the pulmonary arteries, and they are always colored blue because the blood they carry is deoxygenated. The red blood cells then travel to the lungs where they release carbon dioxide and receive oxygen. Now that the red blood cells are oxygenated, they return to the heart to get another push before traveling through the body in the systemic circuit. These blood vessels are headed toward the heart, so they are veins, but they are colored red because the blood they carry is oxygenated. So, this newly oxygenated blood travels back to the heart through the pulmonary veins. Here in the heart, the blood gets a final push before its long trek around the body. Thank you for watching. Learn happily and study happily with Scientist Cindy. Come visit me at scientistcindy.com.